Pisces. Pisces, it's time for the Pisces. Let's see, Pisces, it's September. It is a water week, so it's going to be a good week for you and your relationship, Pisces. So Pisces in relationship, new relationship, love relationship. It's good. A message fell out, Pisces. So it is a week of love. Week begins from the 2nd of September until the 8th. I'm seeing some of you dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person. This person is an older person, 45 years and older. And now you're beginning to see the truth over situations and issue. So what is coming up for you, Pisces, is that whatever that wasn't clear is now clear. Okay, so if you weren't seeing something clear in the past, in this week it's going to be very, very clear what is happening, okay? So Pisces, let's see what is coming out. Please remember to check out the monthly readings. Um, the love readings are going to be up soon, but check out the monthly readings because that's going to help. All right. So this queen of wands is in the reverse. Now this could be a mother figure. This could be coming up for you. Pisces as a mother figure, whoever this person is, this person, um, you're seeing the truth about this person now, whatever that has happened, whatever that has transpired, it's as if you're seeing the truth about this person, whoever this person is. It could be a sister, could be a mother or a friend. This woman is 45 years and older and everything is um, coming out about this lady. I'm seeing it. So it says a mother figure. Definitely. It could be a mother figure or a family. Or this could be your partner. This could be your wife. Um, whatever is coming out is as if everything you're seeing, everything as clear as day now. Okay. Um, whatever that was hidden is now out so if this person was hiding anything it is now out okay because um there is no shedding the light it is now out if you were hiding something from your partner it is now out because they're going to be finding out what is happening transition a lot of um a lot of cards in the reverse so some of you are dealing with um, a scorpion and cancer. Scorpion and cancer. If you are a Pisces in a relationship with a scorpion and cancer, you're going to be finding out a lot about them. So, again, if you're um, if you are in a relationship with a scorpion or a cancer, you're going to be finding out a lot about them. You have a strong foundation, um, you Pisces, whatever is happening. You have a strong foundation against um, this um, um, fire sign person. There is no new start um, between you and a scorpion. Um, there will not be a new start between you and a scorpion because you're seeing the truth of a situation. There is a relationship and it's as if you were in a relationship with uh, someone and you're seeing the truth about this person okay you're seeing the truth about this person um what they did and what has transpired you're definitely seeing the truth about this person what they did and what they have to, what has transpired whatever is transpiring you you stand strong you stand strong um with a situation with an aries leo or sagittarius you stand strong with a situation with an aries leo or sagittarius so let's see what is coming up. What is here? What is coming up for this situation? Because it's the two of cups. The two of cups is that you could be re in a relationship with an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra, but it is also coming up as if it is a mother figure or a sister. And it's all about money. All about money. It is all about money. So some of you who are in relationship, with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, it's all about money. Whatever the issue is, whatever that is transpiring, it's all about money. Whatever that is going on, it's all about money. So for you, Pisces, Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign, 
what is transpired between you and a person because I'm seeing mother issues with money um, some of you are dealing with a mother that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and you have issues with money it's as if this person decide not to give you any more money whatever is transpiring I think this person is protecting themselves and decided not to give you any more money so whatever that was all about now some of you are walking away from a relationship with a Scorpio or a cancer so definitely some of you if you're in a relationship with a Scorpio or a cancer you're walking away from this relationship it is as if this is not what I want in my life whatever the relationship is it is as if this is not what I want in my life so whatever that is transpiring between you and a scorpion in this relationship it's not what you want in your life okay so I'm seeing really the um, energy of uh, some of you just getting up walking away from a scorpion okay um, some of you need to find inner strength some of you need to look within yourself uh, because a situation a transition is about to come upon you and you need to look in yourself so some of you were dealing with a scorpion and a cancer if you were in a relationship with a scorpion and a cancer I'm seeing you walking away and ending this relationship okay whatever the issue is so, um, for some of you um, you need a transition is coming in and you need to look within okay some of you need to look at yourself and see why certain issues in certain situations transpire in your life there it is you need to make a decision some of you need to make a decision um about a scorpion and a cancer you need to make a decision about a scorpion and a cancer i'm seeing either them leaving or you leaving but this um, relationship is not working out anymore some of you your wishes and dreams is in reverse whatever the issue is i'm not seeing a new start for you with a, um, a scorpion your wishes and dreams is in reverse some of you who are dealing with a Pisces or with a cancer or a scorpion I'm not seeing the new start that you wanted to come in it is just not there okay um, um, with your materialistic stability uh, that is also in a ray whatever the issue is whatever that is transpiring for you Pisces the energy of the Empress is here where it is um, the whoever this woman is and whatever she's doing she is the one that is messing um messing it up for you there's some news that is coming in there's fast speed about a house for some of you fast speed about um a new um new start could be coming in because there is some new start some fast speed a offer that you were open to get from a scorpion is not coming in a scorpion or a cancer that has offered you or you want to have a new start with a scorpion or a cancer it is not going to be happening so um, be aware of that um, five of cups you have some regrets you definitely have some regrets you Pisces whatever that was transpiring you Pisces have some regrets um, that is coming up I'm seeing regrets about a relationship um, regrets and and these relationship have to do with scorpion and cancer so whatever that was transpiring between you and a scorpion and a cancer I'm seeing regrets I'm seeing this woman whoever this woman is it has something to do with your materialistic stability um, because the foundation you have a strong foundation but um, what you were open for and 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 what what you were wishing for and open for is not coming in because a Scorpio um, try to break a Scorpio or a cancer try to break this where the Scorpio or the cancer try to do something because you have some regrets you definitely have some regrets because a Scorpio or a cancer had created um, some horrible things and um, some of you were open that a Scorpio or a cancer will reconnect with you but this is definitely not going to be happening for whatever the reason is it's definitely not going to be happening there is definitely some sadness I'm seeing 
the eight of wands um, information is coming in fast it's coming in from a Scorpio or a cancer for some of you there is regrets some of you were open that you could reconciliate with this um, Scorpio or cancer but it's not looking very positive some of you add hope for offers for a new for a house um, a lot of offers are coming in but I am um, a lot of message are coming in but not offers okay so if you are looking for a new house if you want to buy a new house a lot of offers is there but a lot of message is there but no offers okay then we have the energy of the ten of Pentacles the ten of Pentacles is abundancy is money coming in okay so the money is not yet here but it has to do with family um, money it has to do with it's as if you want a new start you have asked your mother for the money but your mom is saying no I am NOT opening I'm not doing this I'm not lending you any money I'm not giving you any money you it's as if your mom is protecting her money herself she's protecting her money and herself she's protecting the money that she has for the family and you have a lot of regrets you you have a lot of regrets because you had hopes and dreams to do something and to build something but you were hoping for family money money from your family and it is not going to be happening so a lot of you are going to be very dis um very disappointed in this week especially people who were hoping for family financial help from the family a lot of you are going to be very disappointed in this week a lot of you are going to be realizing that a Scorpio or a cancer have ruined something for you and um, a lot of you are going to be disappointed okay a lot of you um, hope and I'd wish that this didn't happen whatever has happened because it's as if your your parents I tighten the, the 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 flow of money or someone who was there who was helping you have tightened the flow of money again if you're looking for a new house um, you're going to be receiving a lot of messages but no offers is coming in okay a lot of messages but no offers is coming in I have two cards I have the right hand and I have the left hand if you choose the right hand it is Sonia and she said I bring you a message from your deceased loved ones I am happy at peace and I love you very much please don't worry about me so there is someone out there that your loved one has passed away or someone has passed away and this person is saying you know they're at peace they're okay don't worry about them just get on with your life and this is very very wonderful and very beautiful so whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening there is someone that um, a, a message from a deceased um, loved one is coming in and saying stop worrying I'm okay then we have another beautiful Archangel Archangel Uriel and your emotions are healing which enables you to open to great love I will help you release anger and unforgiveness from your heart and mind okay so whatever is happening Archangel Uriel is coming in to help you because a lot of you are going to be angry because this is if your family or someone who used to help you is going to be tightening the ropes of money and um, you're not going to be happy um, so um, Archangel Uriel is here to help you to release this hanger okay please remember the monthly readings are out go check out the monthly readings and the full moon readings this is good whatever is happening and the situation 111 so open up to positive energy vibration we have three times one so whenever there is a reading there's a portal that is going to be opening up for you Pisces because three times one this is saying that the universal angels are going to make a shift there is going to be a huge paragon shift that is coming up for you Pisces and this is going to be powerful in this week because there is whatever um, you were vibrating in the energies are going to be shifting so if you're listening to this reading it's good to share this reading so that other Pisces will have this paragon shift because right now there is a healing that is coming through for you Pisces because we have 11 um, or 1 11 or 1 so that is three times one where you need to have 
positive thoughts and hope for the best so that you can go with this paragon shift so there's a huge paragon paragon shift that is going to be coming up for you Pisces in this um, week so this is wonderful and beautiful because whatever the issue is and the situation is it is going to be a wonderful and beautiful week um, you can see all of this happening there is intuition is a week of intuition that is going to be coming in I want to say have a wonderful week namaste